What is the aorta? Is it a vein? A lymphatic vessel? An artery? Or a capillary? The correct answer is C that is it is an artery. The aorta is the largest artery in the body responsible for carrying oxygen rich blood from the heart to the rest of the body. Question number 2 Where does the aorta originate? Two options are Left atrium Right atrium Left ventricle Or Right ventricle The correct answer is C that is left ventricle. Aorta arises from the left ventricle of the heart ensuring the oxygenated blood is distributed to the body. Question number 3 Which section of the aorta curves around to form the aortic arch? Two options are Ascending aorta, descending aorta, thoracic aorta, or abdominal aorta. The correct answer is A that is ascending aorta. The ascending aorta is the first part of the aorta that goes to form the aortic arch which then supplies major arteries. Question number 4 Which arteries branch directly from the aortic arch? Two options are Coronary arteries Pulmonary arteries Brachiocephalic artery Left common carotid artery Left subclavian artery or renal arteries. The correct answer is C that is brachiocephalic artery, left common carotid artery and left subclavian artery. These three major arteries branch from the aortic arch to supply blood to the head, neck and upper limbs. Question number fifth. What is the role of aorta? Two options are Remove carbon dioxide from the blood Transport oxygen rich blood to tissue Transport oxygen poor blood to lungs Or filter blood The correct answer is B that is to transport oxygen rich blood to tissues. The aorta is the main conduit for oxygenated blood, delivering it from the heart to all parts of the body. Question number 6 Hello friends, welcome back to Dear Competitive Exam YouTube channel. Today you are attending 50 most repeated and most important question answer session based on aorta and this is the part 1 of this series so let's challenge your quality of learning let's see what will be your score out of 50 from this part 1 so do watch this video completely to make yourself more fit to answer any kind of questions and at the end if you find this video helpful then please do like subscribe and share this video to all your friends who are preparing for upcoming any kinds of medical exams let's continue question number six the thoracic aorta supplies blood to which area your options are legs arms upper chest and abdomen or brain the correct answer is C that is upper chest and abdomen 
the thoracic aorta travels through the chest supplying blood to the chest organ and upper abdomen question number 7 the abdominal aorta bifurcates into which arteries your options are renal arteries coronary arteries iliac arteries or carotid arteries the correct answer is c that is iliac arteries the abdominal aorta splits into the common iliac arteries which supply blood to the lower abdomen pelvis and legs question number 8 which part of the aorta is most prone to aneurysms two options are ascending aorta aortic arch descending aorta or abdominal aorta the correct answer is d that is abdominal aorta the abdominal aorta is particularly susceptible to aneurysms which are bulges in the atrial wall that can lead to rupture question number 9 what type of blood flows through the aorta your options are deoxygenated oxygenated mixed or lymphatic the correct answer is b that is oxygenated the aorta carries oxygen rich blood from the left ventricle to all parts of the body question number 10 what separates the thoracic and abdominal aorta Two options are diaphragm, lungs, liver, or kidneys. The correct answer is A. That is diaphragm. The diaphragm is the muscle that separates the thoracic cavity from the abdominal cavity, dividing the thoracic and abdominal aorta. Question number eleven. Which wall guards the opening of the aorta from the heart? Two options are tricuspid wall, pulmonary wall, mitral wall, or aortic wall. The correct answer is. D that is aortic wall the aortic wall prevents the backflow of blood from the aorta into the left ventricle after contraction question number 12 which of the following is not a branch of the aorta two options are coronary arteries femoral arteries renal arteries or carotid arteries the correct answer is b that is femoral arteries femoral arteries branch from the iliac arteries which come from the aorta but they are not direct branches of the aorta itself question number 13 What is the diameter of the aorta in a healthy adult? Your options are twelve centimeter, thirty-four centimeter, forty-five centimeter, or sixty-seven centimeter. The correct answer is. B that is thirty-four centimeter. 
The normal diameter of the aorta in adults is about 34 cm, allowing it to handle the high pressure of blood flow. Question number 14. Which layer of the aortic wall is the thickest? Your options are Entima, Media, Adventitia or Endothelium. The correct answer is B that is Media. The media layer of the aorta made up of smooth muscle and elastic fibers and is the thickest and provides strength and elasticity. Question number 15. What is an aortic dissection? Two options are blockage of the aorta, rupture of the aorta, tear in the aortic wall, or inflammation of the aorta. The correct answer is. C that is tear in the aortic wall. An aortic dissection is a life threatening condition where the inner layer of the aorta tears, allowing blood flow between the layers. Question number 16 Which condition is characterized by the enlargement of the aorta? Your options are aneurysm, dissection, stenosis or thrombosis. The correct answer is A that is aneurysm. An aneurysm refers to the abnormal bludging or enlargement of the aorta due to weakness in the arterial wall. Question number 17. Which imaging technique is commonly used to visualize the aorta? Two options are X ray, MRI, ultrasound, or angiography. The correct answer is D, that is angiography. Angiography uses contrast dye and x-rays to visualize the aorta and detect abnormalities such as blockages or aneurysms. Question number 18. What is the coarctation of the aorta? Your options are a tear in the aorta. Narrowing of the aorta, enlargement of the aorta, or a wall defect. The correct answer is B that is narrowing of the aorta. Coarctation of the aorta, congenital condition where part of the aorta is narrower than the usual, affecting blood flow. Question number 19. What causes Marfan syndrome to affect the aorta? Two options are genetic mutation, viral infection, trauma, or autoimmune disorder. The correct answer is A that is genetic mutation. Genetic mutation. Morphin syndrome is a genetics disorder that affects connective tissues, making the aorta more prone to aneurysm and dissections. Question number 20. Which artery is the first branch of the ascending aorta? Your options are coronary artery, carotid artery, 
सबक्लाइवियन आर्टरी और फिमोरल आर्टरी द करेक्ट आंसर इज सी दट इज कोरोनरी आर्टरी द कोरोनरी आर्टरीज आर द फर्स्ट ब्रांचेस ऑफ द एसेंडिंग एयोटा सप्लाइंग ब्लड टू द हार्ट इट सेल्फ क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी वन वट इज द प्राइमरी फंक्शन ऑफ द एयोटिक आर्च शो ऑप्शन सर टू सप्लाई ब्लड टू द लंग्स टू डिस्ट्रीब्यूट ब्लड टू द अपर बॉडी टू रेगुलेट ब्लड प्रेशर और टू स्टोर ब्लड करेक्ट आंसर इज बी दट इज टू डिस्ट्रीब्यूट ब्लड टू द अपर बॉडी द एयोटिक आर्च ब्रांचेस इन टू आर्टरीज दट सप्लाई ब्लड टू देड नेक एंड आर्म्स ensuring these regions receive adequate oxygen rich blood question number 22 which condition may lead to aortic regurgitation your options are aortic dissection aortic stenosis hypertension or aortic wall insufficiency the correct answer is d that is aortic wall insufficiency aortic regurgitation occurs when the aortic wall does not close properly causing blood flow backward from the aorta into the left ventricle question number 23 What is the significance of the aorta's elasticity? Your options are: it prevents blood flow, it allows for flexibility during heart beats, it causes hypertension, or it filters blood. The correct answer is. b that is it allows for flexibility during heart beats the elasticity of the aorta helps absorb the pressure from each heart beat allowing it to expand and recoil which maintains blood flow question number 24 what type of blood pressure condition can affect the aorta ऑप्शन सा हाइपोटेंशन हाइपरटेंशन एट्रियल फिब्रिलेशन और ब्रेडिकार्डिया द करेक्ट आंसर इज बी दट इज हाइपरटेंशन हाई ब्लड प्रेशर हाइपरटेंशन कैन स्ट्रेन द एयोटा इंक्रीजिंग द रिस्क ऑफ एन्यूरिज्म और डायसेक्शन ओवर द टाइम question number 25 what does aorta mean in latin your options are branch to lift blood vessel or wall the correct answer is b to lift the term aorta comes from the greek word aorti which means to lift referring to its role in carrying blood away from the heart time is to comment your score out of 25 questions and friends thanks for joining us on this exciting journey if you enjoyed the quiz and learned something new then give us thumbs up and let us know in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on our upcoming exploration of fascinating topics in the medical field until the next time stay curious stay healthy see you